shoot Montet. Why, what's he done? My sense of beauty is undestroyed. How about yourself, Winterbot? Well, looking at you, uh, Mr. Murgatroyd, what sort of hope have I got? Oh, the life of an artist, sad one. Unless they're successful, poor blighters. I take off my hat if I had one. Two painters and sculptors and writers. Yes, isn't, isn't it perfectly marvellous that people, people can write stuff and paint? paint? And sculpt and all that? Just knocks me flat. I wish I were clever. You ain't? Of course, we're proud of the Navy and Army. In history, they play a big part. But believe us or not, we're just balmy. Art, 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 art. Why didn't you turn up yesterday at the Tate Gallery? I went to the National. Who won? Seriously, don't you like picture galleries? No, too far away from the screen. I prefer stalls. As a matter of fact, I've just bought a landscape. How many acres? Six in the top row. I'm going to the dentist tomorrow. Having gas? No, I'm going in the daytime. I'm glad you're interested in paintings. Uh, do you like sergeants? I prefer officers. I'm rather a snob. How about Holbein's? Half's enough for me. I picked up a, a lovely bargain at Rembrandt's sale the other day. What was it called? Lot 22. Oh, well, that's an awful lot. What's the subject? A nude figure doing a hair. Oh, what's the brushwork like? I'm combing to that later. <laughs> I don't know who painted it. Wasn't it written on the bottom? Mm, definitely not. Are you keen on things in oil? Yes, sardines. I like watercolours. What do you think of this miniature? Watercolour. The crimson of that sunrise. It's a sunset. Well, I'm only 12 hours out. How do you know the difference, anyway? If I hold it in the east, it's dawn. If I hold it in the west, vice versa. <laughs> it's a turner, you see. I've got a cousin who's a doctor. He paints, too. Oh, what? Throats with iodine. Oh, he mixes his paint on the palette. Easily. <laughs> do you paint yourself? No, this is sunburn. Do you? I started painting our bathroom the other day. Did you finish it? Yes, once I start painting, I stick to it. So do all the flies, I suppose. Do you like sculpture? Well, I was out on the bust last night. You know, there's something very low in this modern sculpture. Usually the pedestal. I must admit I prefer the old stuff. Look at Venus. Oh, she's quite harmless. Then there's that boy throwing the discus. Oh, don't let's discuss that. Ah. I love those enormous statues, hewn out of granite. Carved out of stone. Modelled out of clay. Hacked out of chalk. Made out of acid. Father out of sight. Mother out of sorts. Sister out of mind. Brother out of bounds. Gags out of book. Us out of work. Enough. Enough. Of course, when I can afford it, I'm going to, uh, I'm going in for alabasters. I beg your pardon? I said uh, alabasters. Oh, I'm going in for marbles. Well, what's the matter with a game of shove -apenny? Obviously, you have no appreciation of art or literature. I've read Dickens. Great Scott. Yes, and him too. Have you read Hans Anderson? They're white, and why call me Anderson? Oh, oh, read Arnold Bennett? Yes. Sabatini? Yes. Maticarelli? No, I married a Miss Smith. Huh. Of course, on the train journey, I like light literature. Such as? Well, inscriptions on matchboxes. <laughs> yes. Isn't it perfectly marvellous? The people can write stuff and paint. And sculpt and all that. It just knocks us flat. We wish we were clever. We ain't. Cause we're proud of the Navy and Army. In history, they play a big part. But believe me or not, we're just balmy on art, 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 on art, art, art. Uh, do you like uh, reading in bed, Murgatroyd? Yes, and my wife turns over. <laughs> Very funny. <laughs>
Where did you go ashore? Marseilles. When? Thursday. I was very disappointed with Florence. Why? She didn't turn up. Uh, did you strike the Nile? Yes, I hit the Nile on the head. How irrigating. We had a ball on board. Did you? Some silly fool knocked it over the side with a bat. That's not cricket. Uh, sort of deck tennis. I suppose you had a sweep on the boat. Of course, to clean the funnels. We had some excitement in mid-ocean. Oh, really? Yeah, a man came on board. What was his name? Albert Ross. Oh, did you go to Jamaica? Yeah. Uh, what did Jamaica, Jamaica? Oh, it's dearer than Madeira. But it's nicer than Nice. Brighter than Brighton. More popular than Poplar. Coarser than Corsica. Farther than Mother. Oh, much. Did you take a camera? I had one of my own. I took a photograph every 20 knots. Every 20 knots? No, no. You're 18 short. Still got the negative? Not. Uh, no. You're getting tied up. In knots. I met some charming people on board. So did I. You couldn't have. They were on my boat. The Leveson Chalmondeles. Lucent Chalmondeles. Oh, thank you. On my boat uh, with the St. John Marjorie Banks. St. John Marjorie Banks. Thank you. <laughs> Is it right that they called you the bar steward's best customer? <laughs> yes, Daddy. Oh, yes. Anyway, I'm very glad I went. And I'm very sorry you came back. What a thrill it was to see the white cliffs of Dover again. I thought you landed in Liverpool. I did, but it was a very clear day. Where did you land? On the back of my neck. I mean, where did you get in? Uh, Victoria Station. Where did the boat get in? Oh, we left that behind. Why? Well, I promised I wouldn't tell anybody, you see. Ah, oh, but it's good to get back in England again. A life on the ocean way. Oh, winter bottom, you sing grandly. And I've heard you sing as Tommy Handley. Ronald Franco, ain't you swell? I'm on next week as well at the BBC. Indeed to goodness. Mister, look you. I can't think why on earth they book you. Oh, they're wise, the BBC. Yes, they're always using me. Other double turns they've got them. No, no announcers, announcers ever, ever shot them. Though they're copybooks, they blot them. Murgatroyd. And winter bottom. Never would. Though nothing could be so absurd as us agree if you've heard us. That our speed postpones our murders. Nobody has time to bird us if they could. Sing tra-la-la, -la, why tra-la-la, -la, folk singers always do. Sing hey, sing hey, sing hey, hey hi ho you. I hear you went away on a cruise the other day. Yeah, we've just done that. Yeah, didn't someone say encore? No, I don't think so, anyway. 